The football season starts tomorrow for the EFL and we've all got that tingly start of season feeling, haven't we? I was kindly invited to attend the launch event for the EFL on Quest show hosted at the Valley yesterday. Special guests Colin Murray, Ian Holloway, Karen Carney and Chris Powell were there to be part of the fans forum and Q&A at the event. This is a little bit of footage from the day. So I don't yet know if this is going to be its own standalone video or part of another video but right now I'm in the car and I'm heading to the valley and they are hosting at the valley an EFL event which is basically the launch event for the new football league show which is shown on Quest. Um, I think Chris Powell's going to be there and so I think it's going to be quite a good little time. I have no idea what to expect. I think there'll be more vloggers and bloggers and all that, those types of people there from all the teams across the EFL. So yeah, I don't know what it's going to be like so I don't know if I'm going to get a full video's worth of content. If so, then this will be the intro. If not, you might see this randomly in another video or it might just be a really short video. I don't know. Either way, let's go to the valley and find out what this little event is all about. All right, so we've arrived at the valley. Before we do anything though, we have to go into the Charlton Athletic Superstore and get ourselves a shirt for this event because they very specifically said you must be wearing your club shirt. So I don't know what size I am. So we're gonna go in right now. I might have put a little bit of timber on over the last few years. I used to be a small, but I feel like I very well may be a medium now. Anyway, boring details. Let's go into the store and cop one of the brand new challenge shirts. Alright, let's go get one. Yeah, I wanted to try on a small and a medium for the home shirt. Is that alright? Cool. Cheers. Oh, we've got a little large. I'll try one of these and one of these. Alright, so current situation, lots of fans from all various clubs in the EFL, all sitting down in front of the, I think, Skybet League 1, yeah. League 2 and Championship trophies, I believe. Um, <laughs> I don't know my trophies very well, but that's currently the situation. We're just waiting for something to happen. It's a very weird dynamic, because I'm literally, like, normally I'd arrive at the Valley, oh, it's not starting, false alarm. But today, it's very much different. We're with a load of fans, uh, we're at an EFL event. I don't know what's going to happen, but we're here, sat in front of the trophies. Um, everybody's just sort of waiting for something to start. I think there's going to be a lot of good conversations between fans today and networking and that kind of type of thing. But um, other than that, yeah, just intrigued to see what happens. We're not going to get around you all today. You are all invited to come in with us next season. We'll take your contacts. You can come and see how the show works, how we put it together how we film it and how it goes out. So the rest of the day was spent listening to Colin, Chris, Ian and Karen doing various speeches as well as being part of a fans forum and Q&A panel. It was just generally really quite interesting to hear people that live and breathe football literally uh, just talk about football and get involved with the fans in this very exciting phase when there's only a few days left to go before the season kicks off. And I think this panel dynamic with these particular pundits will be really good. Like they were laughing and joking and bounced off each other really well. So the show should be really good. And they seemed very excited about the progression of the EFL show on Quest and discuss things like how the show is going to be longer now to allow more time to talk about League One and League Two games and teams and fixtures and things. It was a, anyway, it's a really cool event. Um, obviously, this isn't a sponsored video or anything. It's just cool to relay sort of what happened at the event to you guys and obviously get a little bit involved as well in that in that pre-season hype. So that was a very interesting day, something that came up last minute for me and I don't regret going at all. It was a really worthwhile event to go to, really interesting to sit and hear the panel of sort of Chris Powell and Holloway and that. Um, Colin Murray just talk about the upcoming season and talk about um, you know why they love football why the EFL is so great why it's so great that you know fans do things like fan sites YouTube channels and you know everything in between and it was just a really good insight and you know you get to network with people you get to talk to other fans you get to see how they're feeling about the season you get to do all that kind of stuff and that is what the event was all about and it was really great. We actually got a goodie bag so just to end off this video I'm going to see what the EFL on Quest goodie bag actually contains. We're going to open it on this semi messy bed right now so excuse that but here we go. Alright here is the EFL on Quest bag inside. The first thing that we are going to find is Oh, an actual full-on meter of football. That's actually decent. Let's actually get this out of here. If I can get this bag off. Here we go. That is a full-on EFL brand.
branded meter football. The I've not got autofocus on, so I have to leave it there. But that is a nice little quality football. Not that I play a lot of physical football these days, but I am moving soon, and there are some, there is some green area around where I live, so maybe we can get over and give that a go. Uh, also inside the EFL bag, let's see. I think there's only one more thing actually, and it is a EFL on Quest branded water bottle, I believe. That's good, I like it. Nothing else in there apart from the actual bag itself, which is even in itself quite a cool bag. The new season is giving everybody football fever, so get behind your team, enjoy the season. There'll be plenty of videos coming right here on my YouTube channel across the season. Take care of yourselves, I'll see you later, and sweet.